knowing that you guys are seeking to leave your job by starting a t-shirt business for free at home online and scouring through all of these videos i figured since the name of my channel is anti-job university i should help you quit your job by starting a t-shirt business for free at home online so yes i did stuff all those keywords into the beginning of this video so give me a jet lee sidekick to the like button to help me with the algorithm won't you all right so we're going to show you two methods in this video that will help you to start this t-shirt business in less than an hour did you know that while you're getting dressed for work getting ready to go clock in in that same amount of time you could be starting your t-shirt line so we're gonna need three things <clears throat> so and all three of these things are kind of pretty much free i'll just say well a couple of them are free so i gotta keep my word okay because the keyword says free okay so i guess i won't even show you guys facebook ads i wanted to show you how to facebook ads but i'll show you a different one okay <clears throat> all right so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to google trends right now you're like well david we don't even have the design well before this video ends i'm gonna show you a free fast way within an hour to start the t-shirt business design okay all right <clears throat> all right so I'm trying to click on this, but Zoom will not allow me to while I'm recording this. Sucks. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to go to some type of movement. So we have sports. Let's check out what sports is trending in the past day. All right. When you're starting a t-shirt business or any, you're trying to sell anything, the easiest way to get conversions is to rally behind some type of movement. <clears throat> so you can check out what sports are happening, what's trending right now, what's it going trending searches right now. All right, Mark Hammond, okay, Hillary Clinton, Ravens. Here we go. So we got the Ravens, we got the Dodgers, we have Atlanta Braves, uh, DC Comics, Superman. Oh, get out of here with that. We got the Eternals. We don't want to get any copyright situations, you know, uh, coming our way, okay? We don't want that. So we're going to stay away from anything like that. I'm going to show you exactly how before this video ends. So the Dodgers has 1 million searches right now. This is as of five hours ago and as of four hours ago, people are rushing to search the uh, the Ravens. Okay, so boom. <clears throat> so no, you can't use their logo and you can't use their, uh, you know, any of their branding or anything like that, but you can use them as the movement. All right, another thing what you're gonna do is you're going to use SEO, Ravens, boom. Look at this. Take a look, baby. Take a look. Take a look. All right. So as you can see, is an Amazon ranking on the first page? Is a Walmart ranking on the first page? Did you know that you can upload items to Amazon? Did you know that you can upload items to Walmart? Okay. So you can do that within an hour's time. Okay. Amazon might need to approve you, which could take a little second, but you can definitely upload straight to Walmart. Another thing you can do within an hour is get in here, okay? This is the Google My Business snack pack area. We call it the snack pack because 85 to 90 something percent of the sales come from this area right here. Here are some related keywords over here for the Ravens, Baltimore Ravens t-shirt jersey, Baltimore Ravens t-shirt, Baltimore Ravens t-shirt Amazon. These are things that people are searching right now. So if you were to get up in here right now, if you already have a website, and if you don't have a website, then it's very simple. You can get in here with the Google My Business. Let me just show you. Uh, we'll go to Google My Business. I'm not logged into the one that I want to be logged into. Well, how about this? I'll just show you. You'll just type in Google My Business tutorial, okay? So basically, it's very simple. Within like, <laughs> they got long videos. Within like five minutes, you'll be able to set up a Google My Business. And what you would name the Google My Business listing is the keyword that you're trying to rank for, whether it's Baltimore Ravens t-shirt, uh, Baltimore Ravens t-shirt, Amazon, blah, blah, blah. Basically, when a person type in Ravens t-shirt, just like what you see right here, is gonna pop up right here. Your listing will be first, and if you have a link to where they can purchase your t-shirt, that'll be good, which brings us to the next part. Okay, so you want to design your t-shirt. You can come to Canva for free. They have template, templates. Look at that t-shirt. Boom. All righty. So you want a blank t-shirt. You don't want, I mean, you could use one of these templates, but I, I, I like template. I like um, to use it blank. 
Okay, and so basically all you would do is say something real slick. So remember, you can't use the branding and you can't make it, um, you can't make it <laughs> obvious, okay? You can't make it obvious. And what I mean by that is you don't wanna be saying the Ravens beat the Dodgers or something like that, you know what I'm saying? You say the only way to fly is being a raven or the freest way to fly is being a raven okay or, or or if you know somebody's name on the team then you would throw that in there or something be a little creative with it you guys can come up with something i don't know anything about the ravens that's why I, just be creative don't make it obvious don't don't say hey if you want this ravens t-shirt the ravens won last night yeah no no when i did the um deontay wilder fight uh, versus Tyson Fury the other day. You can look at that video. Um, I used their last names or I used the first names. I didn't use the both first and last names and I didn't say the boxing match, didn't say the third fight or any of that type of stuff. I literally said uh, this night couldn't get any wilder until Tyson KO'd him. That could be Mike Tyson. That could be Tyson Chicken. That could be, you can use any name you want to use, you know, unless he has his name, like just the name period Tyson copyrighted. I don't know about that. But anyway, so that's what you can do. This is the SEO portion of it. All right. And then you can rank through trends as well. Okay. So now that you know this is trending, you want to rank for the trends and you want to rank in backpack right here so that you can get long-term sales. Okay. And that's, you would just repeat that, that uh, technique over and over and over, build up your income. You can use sports, you can use celebrities, you know what I'm saying? As you can see, John Kuzak is on there. You can say, I guess, I guess he, uh, I guess he never left room 1408 because that was the last movie I watched from him. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, what it means to be an eternal, you know what I'm saying? And you can just have the outline of them. You can't put them in there, but people know what the outline of Salma Hayek looks like most of You understand what I'm saying? Okay, stuff like that, you know, or a little line from Demi Lovato's song, like a little quote, but don't actually put the name of the song and don't put her name. But drop in little things like that that only her top fans would know and then target them all right, using rankings that are free. Okay, so that is super simple. That's how you can get this set up. You can just throw in a Google My Business listing in like an hour, like less than an hour, it will be ranking if you use instant verification. If you don't know how to use instant verification, text me in the description. If you need help setting this up, text me in the description. This is Anti-Job University, where we help you turn your passion into ways to cash in so you can quit that job. Do that today. Now, you shouldn't feel great putting on your uniform right now, getting ready to clock in, knowing that within an hour, you can have this set up, okay? So let's do that.